this is the 109th day of quarantine still boring it's crazy I'm going insane I don't even know what to do why why is this I'm going out of shape that's the worst part I don't know okay Ajay is up a lot of people due to this COVID-19 due to quarantine due to getting bored are going through mental instabilities the science behind this is you know uh, if you get bored the probability of you getting heart diseases is increasing don't worry I'm not gonna allow that to happen to you and that's the reason in today's video I'm gonna give you six ways to stop getting bored that means I'm not gonna allow you to get bored so let's have it number one start taking challenges okay so if you want to achieve something if you just start it blindly there's a lot of chances you're gonna fail it but the thing is if you take that that goal in a challenging way as a challenge 99 percentage you're gonna win it in and this has been proved by a lot of scientists and this small trick is followed by a lot of billionaires millionaires whatever it is if you do this small trick you know your brain muscles love taking challenges and this one thing is even gonna help you stop procrastinating and whatever it is example if you wanna increase your knowledge two books a month maybe three books a month for you if you wanna have more guns 200 push-ups a day 200 pull-ups a day anything take it as a challenge and that's gonna change everything number two start trying something new okay just think before this pandemic, what we used to do, we used to do the same thing again and again and again. We used to go to school or we used to go to office, we used to come home and we used to think about that homework or we used to think about that office things and all those stuff. But now, after the pandemic, our whole routine has been changed. And the thing is, now we got 24 hours just like that. So you can't give any complaints that you don't have time. Now, you got 24 hours and you know you can try anything at this time and one of the signs behind this is when you try something new there's a hormone called dopamine produced example you want to start maybe C++ coding you want to learn first time when you learn this dopamine is produced and it makes you do it again and again this is what helps you to build the interest over it anything maybe you want to improve your skills in dancing anything like maybe you want to create a youtube channel maybe singing anything start trying now because this is the perfect time number three start reading okay myself and a lot of us you know we may be having complaints you want me to go out the pandemic is going on out there you want me to go buy a book and start reading even i thought about it but the thing is it doesn't need to start reading it doesn't need to go out and buy during this pandemic but the thing is there's a lot of free google books online those books are awesome the free books a lot of free books and you know myself i'm not a huge fan of reading for people like us who don't like reading the solution audible spotify podcast just click it on sit calmly in a peaceful place and listen there's nothing for you to read just listen that's more than enough. Number four, start posting. No, 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 don't misjudge me. I'm not talking about posting your quarantine pics. I'm talking about posting your creativity, your talent. You know, after this pandemic, I noticed a lot of new, new pages on Instagram upcoming. Uh, those pages were posting their creativity, their talent, their arts, like, yeah, all of this. So, you know, you can also try something like this the reason is now you gotta understand one thing according to research after the pandemic the research has told that the number of people on internet has gone 25 to 30 percentage higher that means you know an average person is scrolling nearly thousand posts on social media so even if one of that post is yours and if it's good you gotta like so don't stop posting your creativity because there's uh, you know there's more probability of getting going viral this time number five terrace or balcony farming okay don't give me that lame old excuse that you don't have place or area in your home to plant you see what's happening in this present day nature is taking over us so it's really important for us to create a good partnership with nature create that small contribution from our side is increasing our frustration you know that's we can do that in a big amount in a huge amount outside but 
Now we are inside home. So the best thing is planting small, small plants. It can be done with anything. Anything. A small water bottle, a small pot. So don't give me that excuse that you can't do it. You don't have area. Balcony, wherever this place, plant it. That's, that's going to help us for the long term. That's really important. That rolls on to number six, start teaching. This reminds me of a thought. Anyone can teach anyone anything so that everyone comes to know everything. This thought is 100% truth. Just think. You are teaching something to someone and he or she teaches to someone else and he or she teaches to someone else. This cycle never stops. It's an endless cycle. It continues again and again forever. So this is really, really important. You know, the best way to start implementing is post whatever good knowledge you have on the internet. As you know, internet is a really, really diverse platform. So whatever you're going to, good thing you're going to post on the internet, it's going to reach the vast number of population. So this cycle will be continuing forever. So that's really for this video guys. Those were the six ways through which you can stop getting bored. And if you found informative, don't forget to drop us a like down below. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and press that all notification so that you get all the notification whatever video we post. And that's it for me today. See you next video.